Mental health has been an issue that we've been dealing with. This pandemic has made it even worse. It's bigger than academics. Our kids need us to be there for them. Creating a safe space is needed. So this is just kind of like a therapy session and it gives students opportunities to kind of wind down, do some vision boards, maybe even some drawing, some things that can help calm them. I'm Dakota Huber. Um, I'm in the 12th grade and I'm in Sources of Strength. So I'm Christopher Smith. I'm the superintendent of Cherry Creek Schools. Sources of Strength is a class that develops campaigns and activities so that students can participate and apply their strengths to a positive light. We actually did a generosity and spirituality campaign here. It says, um, what do you do to help others? I really like check-in to say good night and good morning. Sometimes, myself included, can get kind of in their head feeling, you know, uh, I don't think someone cares about me or I'm just feeling a little down today. Sometimes a, a good morning or even just a, hey, how are you, just makes me like, oh, sweet, someone cares. My mental health was suffering. I felt like I was a horrible little sister. I wrote a letter to my favorite teacher telling him how I was feeling so sad and um, just not, not doing well. And uh, it was really concerning to him and he told my parents the one thing I didn't want him to do because I was really scared of my parents finding out. But I'm glad they did. It can be intimidating to talk to someone older than you or someone who's a professional. As we talk about sources of strength, the main piece of it is to make our students feel welcome. If a friend of mine comes up to me and is saying, this person is acting a little different than usual, all of us that were in that conversation, we don't fastly approach, like we don't want to scare them. We approach them and kind of ask them like, hey, are you okay? We've noticed some things are happening. And then that kind of starts the conversation up. What stresses us out with like school or when we're really angry about something and we usually help each other out. Like, you know, hey, I know you're feeling this way, but Let's work on it together. If a student has someone to go talk to, a trusted adult, that can make the biggest difference in their life. Because if they walk into our schools and they feel loved, they feel invested in, and they feel valued, they won't hurt themselves and they won't hurt others. I've been impacted by suicide and I've been impacted by mental health. We have a saying here, hurt people, hurt people. And so we need to do whatever we can to engage and push in and make sure that our kids feel loved, valued, and invested in. I think it's really important for students to be able to have some trust built with the teacher. The sky's the limit.